Hello everybody and welcome to Dessert Universe. Today we will be making eclairs. They're not as hard to make as some might think and this one will have amazing filling with a beautiful chocolate coating. So what you're gonna receive for your base is water, eggs, flour mixed with salt and butter. So let's get started. So you add the butter, your water, and now it's time to move to the stove. Put it on a high heat. Make sure your butter is melted before the water is hot. As soon as the butter is melted and the water is reaching the boiling point, take it off. Because we don't want to reduce the intake of water here that can misbalance the whole mixture. Now you can see that the water is boiling. I'm gonna take it off, dump the whole flour in in one go and just mix it well. When all the flour is absorbed and kind of cooked, <laughs> we're gonna move it back to the heat to evaporate any excess water that still remains. Make sure that all the flour is absorbed before you put it back on a heat. Now you can see it's kind of ready as one. It's exactly what you need. Okay. Now you put it back on a heat. Mix it well until you get a nice little coating at the bottom of a dry flour. And you can see it's getting more and more condensed now. Really holds well together. This is about it. This is what we were waiting for. The last thing remaining is to add eggs. Just make sure that the base that you just cooked is cooled off about to 60 degrees before you can add it, otherwise you're gonna cook the egg. So what we're gonna do, we're just gonna start with half first and mix it well before we uh, finish with the remainder of the egg. Add half. and then just start mixing it really well. If you see the egg gets a little bit white, it means that you're cooking it, so the base is still too hot. Make sure you mix the egg well before you add more. Now you can see the egg has mixed well. the consistency that you need. Let's fold down from the spoon in a nice triangle shape. So now the last thing to do before we can bake our egg layers is to mix it well until you get that nice shine for about two three minutes. Now you're ready to get your eclairs in the baking sheet. The easiest thing to do is to take the Ziploc bag, put it on the glass or cup, fill it up with your mixture, make sure it's at the bottom, close the bag, 
find a better corner. Make sure that you don't have your dough there. Cut it out. Two. Leave adequate space because they're going to get bigger, much bigger than this right now. Now just use the remaining of your egg that was left and try to even up. Now we're gonna put our eclairs into the hot oven, 410 degrees Fahrenheit for about five minutes. And then you're gonna reduce it to 375 and your eclair will need to stay on for about 30, 35 minutes. So the cream for eclairs will be custard based. What you're gonna receive in your kit is egg, milk, flour, condensed milk, butter, get a pot, Start with your egg, just pour it in, whisk it nicely, so it's kind of all in one, then add your condensed milk, stir it up a little bit, so it's more or less combined. Add the flour, stir it gently, and then add the milk. Well, all ingredients are nicely combined. You ready? To move to the stir, use medium high heat to heat it up. Stir it, make sure everything is dissolved nicely, and then we're just going to make it more thicker, and I will show you what consistency you need to achieve. So now you can see it's getting a bit thicker. So maybe just, just one more minute and it will be done. Let me see. Perfect. And now you move it to the bowl and let it cool off. So just put the clean foil on top and make sure you put it directly on the custard cream. That will ensure that it doesn't get dry while it's cooling off. And you need to bring it to the room temperature before we can mix it with the butter. Nice and easy. Okay. When the custard is fully cold, the only thing you need to do is to add the butter. So the first thing you do, you beat up the butter. The butter needs to be room temperature. And after that, you just slowly add the custard in. big spoon of custard and mix it up. Look how beautiful this is. This is amazing. The final thing to do is to do the chocolate coating. What you're gonna receive is cocoa and sugar, milk, butter. The first thing you do, you put your cocoa and sugar in the bowl pan in this case and add milk. Mix it and move to the stir 
put it on medium high heat, stir it consistently for about three, five minutes. The last thing to do is to add your butter into your hot mixture. Don't wait for it to get cooler, it actually needs to be hot. And then you just make sure all the butter is melted. And your beautiful, tasty chocolate coating is ready. So the last thing to do is just to put your beautiful eclairs together. Cut it up in your eclair. On the side, as you can see, it's a plenty of space for the cream. Okay, add your cream inside nicely. Close down, and the last final touch is just to use a little bit of chocolate coating on the top. And enjoy! Voila! Thank you for watching! Please visit Dessert Universe for more exciting recipes.